Hello students, let's go ahead with the role of women in revolution. Women played a very significant role in the French Revolution. It was their active participation which brought important changes in the French society. Most of the women belonging to the third estate worked for a living. Their occupations included dressmakers, laundry workers, flower vendors, fruit and vegetable vendors, etc. Sometimes they worked as maid servants in the houses of the rich. They were not trained for any job and were largely uneducated. Only the daughters of the nobles and wealthier members of the third estate could study at a convent. Besides caring for their families, the French women had to cook fetch water, stand in queues for bread, look after the children, etc. Their wages were always lower than the men. Women in France were disappointed with the constitution of 1791. It reduced them to passive citizens who had no political rights. They demanded political rights like right to vote, to be elected to the assembly and to hold political office. To express their own views and demands, women started their own political clubs and newspapers. About 60 women's clubs came up in different cities of France. Of them, the Society of Revolutionary and Republican Women was the most famous. Women were active participants in revolutionary activities. In the early years, laws were passed to improve their lives. These changes were, they gained access to education with the introduction of the state schools and a system of compulsory education for girls. Women could no longer be forced into marriages by their fathers they could marry at will. Marriage was now a contract which could be registered under civil law. Divorce was made legal. Both men and women could apply for it. Women could train for jobs, become artists or run a small business. During the reign of terror, the government ordered for the closure of women's clubs and banned their political activities. Many prominent women were arrested and executed. Olympe de Gauze was one of the most important politically active women in revolutionary France. She wrote a Declaration of the Rights of Women and Citizens and demanded that the French women should be given the same rights as French men. In 1793, she criticized the Jacobin government for forcibly closing down women's club. She was executed. During Reign of Terror, for going against Robes Pair. Women's struggle for voting and equal political rights was carried on through an international suffrage movement during the late 19th and early 20th century. Finally, in 1946, French women won the right vote. That's all for today. Thank you. Have a nice day.